Korea machines have just been sold at Mac 2024. They will be going into what will be their largest subcontract machine shop in Europe. And this here is the man behind the purchase, Steve Fitzpatrick from WEC Group. Steve, congratulations. Thank you very much. This is very exciting. It's good news for um, the guys at Courier and our team back at WEC Group. Obviously, we're looking at building what will become the largest subcontract machine shop in Europe when we finish the project. A factory of the future, I hear. Correct, yeah, and we'll have a number of Courier machines. So this is like a partnership for ourselves and the guys at Nicholas Courier, who we've worked with for 20 years now. Um, this will be our sixth Courier, seventh Courier, sorry, seventh Courier purchase so far. Um, and we're looking at extensions on that going into the next two to three years. I've got to ask the question, you've just told me that you've been working with them for 20 years. So there's history there. So why go for more? What is it that they do right where you go, we know we need more? I think when you look at it, it's the full package that we get from these guys at Coria. It's not only the machine tools, which are obviously fantastic. When you look at this thing we're starting here, it's a testament to that. It's also the package, the support from the guys at DTS. Um, the sales guys at, uh, at Coria are very, very good when listening to the, our needs. And of course, the needs of our customers. So the growth has been driven by our customers and the, the future outlook for the WC Group, which is very, very healthy. Um, and we've seen that we would need more capacity of this size. And that's why we're here today, placing an order for four large couriers. Tell me more about the factory of the future. What are your growth plans then? And well, why? Why are you trying to expand what's happening in industry? Well, we, we're um, the, the group itself obviously look, are into metal manufacturing, we're into laser profiling, CNC machining, fabrication, um, and we just see growth year on year based upon our the standard of service we offer our customers, the quality, the delivery. Um, um, and so we've seen the growth in the area of machining and also nuclear fabrication. So the factory will also house a facility, a clean facility for stainless steel nuclear fabrication, again, for, which is something we've seen um, great growth potential in. One more question then. You said service and support is so important to you, and I know from Korea's perspective, they, they hone in a lot within this sector. What is it that they're doing for you that makes you go, yep, yeah, that, that works for us? We very rarely have problems, and I mean very, very rarely. We've Within the group, we've probably 100 machine tools across different sites, um, and I would say the guys at Corrie are up there with, from reaction time for ourselves, if a machine tool goes down, it's costing us cash straight away, it's costing us customer um, confidence. If I pick the phone up to the guys at Corrie and DTS, they're there, if not the same day, the next morning. So really, we can't ask for more than that from a, um, a supply colleague. And when are the machines going in? The first machine will be delivered, hopefully, in December. The first two machines in December, with the follow-on to the December after that. So, and we'll keep on that programme of build for the next four years. Exciting times ahead. Very exciting, yes.